extrovert to my introvert, the confidence to my lack of, the smile to my frame, the warmth to my cold, the home where I belong. Uh, firstly, I would just like to say, Alice, you look absolutely stunning. Even though it's pouring with rain today, you have shone in my heart. I'm going to move on swiftly and tell Alice how amazing she looks today. Beautiful, smart and hardworking. Honestly, Jordan, I don't know how you've done it. Jordan, please repeat after me, but speak directly to Alice. I promise to give you my love and friendship. I promise to give you my love and friendship. To be there when you need me most. To be there when you need me most. To laugh with you, to cry with you. To laugh with you, to cry with you. And to confide in you. And to confide in you. To trust you, to comfort you. To trust you, to comfort you. And to support you. And to support you. All that I have, I share with you. All that I have, I share with you. I promise to respect you. I promise to respect you. And be faithful to you always. And be faithful to you always. These promises I make. These promises I make. For the rest of my life. For the rest of my life. And I give you this ring. And I give you this ring. As a token of our marriage. As a token of our marriage. Thank you. Perfect. So Tom, can you please pass Jordan's ring to Alice, thank you. And again, Alice, please pop it on the third finger of his left hand, hold it there and repeat after me. I promise to give you my love and friendship. I promise to give you my love and friendship. To be there when you need me most. To be there when you need me most. To laugh with you, to cry with you. To laugh with you, to cry with you. And to confide in you. And to confide in you. To trust you, to comfort you. To trust you, to comfort you. And to support you. And to support you. All that I have, I share with you. All that I have, I share with you. I promise to respect you. I promise to respect you. And be faithful to you always. And be faithful to you always. These promises I make. These promises I make. For the rest of my life. For the rest of my life. And I give you this ring. And I give you this ring. As a token of our marriage. As a token of our marriage. <laughs> <laughs> right? If it's okay? Yes, yeah, okay. Good. <laughs> Good. Good. I am proud to say I will be walking down the aisle to you with a smile on my face, a tear in my eye, and so much love in my heart. What a journey it has been. We've been through ups and downs. We bought our first house together, been on amazing holidays together, got engaged, and now here we are today. Now we sit here today as husband and wife, it's hard for me to put in words how I feel about you. I would like to say how beautiful you look today. We spent a lot of time trying to make this day perfect, but as all it was needed was for you to be walking down the aisle to me today. So can I please ask you if you can to be upstanding? Thank you. As a father, I waited to hear that dreaded word, boys. <laughs> One name kept cropping up through the grapevine, Jordan, a rugby player who played for Whitehall, one of the oldest clubs in Bristol, with a great tradition. At least I knew he'd be calling me sir. <laughs> for the sunny day. <laughs> I know marriage is for better or for worse, but Jordan, you couldn't do any better, and Alice, you couldn't do any worse. <laughs> Mum has done an amazing job in bringing me up and helping me blossom into the amazing, handsome man you see before you today. <laughs> You've done an amazing job, and it's hard to believe I am as perfect as I am. <laughs> got one more special present, which I know you will always use. This is Jordan's sixth yes. <laughs> Okay, so there you go. 
you need to, you need to carry that around with you all night, or that's your your personal present for me because I know you like to be sick quite a lot. In a time of so much uncertainty, it's nice to know I have you for certain. I feel privileged to be here with you today, and I stood by you as your husband. It's clear to see I am most certainly punching. <laughs> there is nothing I would change about you, Alice, and I don't know where I would be without you. You have guided me through rocky roads and motivated me when I felt down, always pushing me to better myself, and most of all, loving me. You are the most kind, caring, thoughtful person I know. A cliche well suited. Ladies and gentlemen, a toast to the bride. To Alice. <laughs> It's going to be Jordan first, please. I call upon these persons. I call upon these persons. Here present. Here present. To witness that I. To witness that I. Jordan Ryan Lucas. Jordan Ryan Lucas. Do take thee. Do take thee. Alice Eleanor Wardle. Alice Eleanor Wardle. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. Please repeat after me. I call upon these persons. I call upon these persons. Here present. Here present. To witness that I. To witness that I. Alice Eleanor Wardle. Alice Eleanor Wardle. Do take thee. Do take thee. Jordan Ryan Lucas. Jordan Ryan Lucas. To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. You push my boundaries and allow me to be the person I truly am. I am me when I'm with you. I'm not shy, I'm not anxious, I'm just me. I feel so utterly comfortable with you and I'm so thankful to you for making me feel like that. I adore absolutely everything about you. When I think of you, I see your bright blue eyes that twinkle when you smile and the most beautiful dimples that make me feel that bit more in love with you every single time you make me feel unconditional happiness just by walking through the door. Last couple of weeks, I've been asked if I am nervous. The answer was yes, of course I was. Nervous about the ceremony, the first dance, and especially this speech. But I've never had a single doubt that getting married to Alice will be the best thing I'll do in my life. I would like to thank the new in-laws for what an amazing job they've done in bringing Alice up. She is smart, beautiful and funny. I would like to thank both Adele and Simon for accepting me into their family and also taking the short straw in this exchange. I thought then that you and Alice would get on, and nine years later, here we all are. Over those nine years, it has been a delight and pleasure. I couldn't have wished for, for Alice to meet a nicer chap, and I'm proud and honoured to welcome you to our family. You're a credit to your parents. We've spent days even weeks apart, but we do it and get through it because it's you and me, and we will make everything work. I will support anything you want to do in life and will be stood right by your side all the way encouraging you. Congratulations, Jordan and Alice. You have both now made the declarations required by law and have made promises to each other in the presence of your witnesses, family and friends and us registrars gathered here today. It gives me a great pleasure to announce that indeed you are husband and wife.
life and even in these challenging times, Jordan, I'm sure you can kiss your wife. <laughs> I'd just like to say a few words, Alice. Alice, your smile radiates love and kindness. May you be happy in everything you do. With Jordan's love, I'm sure you will. It's an honor to hand you over to be Jordan's wife as you reach the next stage of your life. Work together in all you do, even when Jordan's pissed and just wants to cuddle the <laughs> I wish you all the love for Jordan and you and hope you have many children too. Congratulations to you both. And we'd like to raise a glass to Mr. and Mrs. Lucas, Jordan and Alice. Cheers. Thank you.